Hey everyone, how are you? Uh, another great video today because this one's going to be about a really good way to make money. It specifically is going to be about um, recurring revenue and subscriptions and how you can leverage that for your business to make sure that your revenue streams are very healthy and good. And so let me explain why it's so good to have a recurring revenue stream through subscriptions. The trick, the, the general sort of, a, I guess, a secret, not a, really a secret, but uh, is that people, first of all, they forget or don't, they don't forget, but they tend to not unsubscribe. You know, the difference is if they have to buy something every month versus, you know, then they're like, oh, you know, I don't know if I want to buy that thing next month. But if they're already subscribed, then actually they have to take action to unsubscribe. And they're like, well, you know, maybe I shouldn't. They give themselves reasons, and that's why they don't unsubscribe. Um, this is a reason. This is uh, a reason like why gyms work. You know, gyms are very difficult to start at the beginning, but what happens is over time you just accumulate so many people. They don't even go to the gym, but they still pay the membership, right? And and that's that model in at its best in a way. Um, you know, you, you don't necessarily want to do that to people, but but that's what happens. Um, and you, but you but the other really great thing about subscriptions is that, you know, unlike when you are selling a product uh, on a one by one each case each time, you know, every month in that case you have to start from zero, right? And you have to sell more than you sold last month in order to have growth. But with subscriptions. You actually don't need to do that. You just need to sell more than the people who unsubscribe. And the people who are, are going to unsubscribe are not that many for most subscriptions. So that's the beauty of subscriptions. And that's the beauty of the recurring revenue model. Because let's say that, you know, if you, I mean, whatever you charge. It, it, it can end up being over, you know, if it's like a monthly charge, it can end up being for years. So even if you charge like a small nominal fee, like a 99 cents or a couple of dollars, over time, that becomes a very valuable customer. Um, and if you've seen my, my other videos about business models and revenue models, uh, what I always talk about is how to get the most, uh, how to generate the most cash from a customer, right? Uh, because few people are going to pay. So the ones that do, um, you want to make sure that you have a way to get the most out of those guys. Because that's how your business will survive. Uh, I mean, it, all, it, it definitely depends on the kind of business that you have. But it's a, it's a really good practice to identify who are the people who are able to spend and have a way for them to spend more. This is kind of a... A recurring um, there's a number of companies who do this successfully um, maybe you guys know Zynga the guy the, the company who made that the, the video games that the Farmville Mafia, uh, Mafia Wars that's what they did uh, and they sold um, you know they sold virtual currency which is kind of like money but it's not real money right it's money in, only inside that game so almost nobody bought it I mean it's ridiculous right no, almost no one bought it, but some people, they bought like tens of thousands worth because they just were so hooked into the game and once they started buying a little bit, buying a little bit more made sense and so, so, so Zynga, what they did really well is they found out how to get the most money out of a customer. They didn't do it through a subscription or recurring model, but they figured out how to get the most money. But the reason why the recurring revenue model works so well is because over time it's one of the great ways to get the most out of a customer. Not to mention that whenever they're re-engaged with your brand, you know, they're more likely to throughout that time recommend it to friends, things like that, right? So you, you actually want that long-term relationship. You want to figure out how to have a long-term relationship with your customers because Number one, it's going to give an, a reason or an excuse to create a subscription for something. 
And number two is that you kind of want them to be with you because your customers are also your marketers, right? They're your marketers. They're, they're a lot of things. So a lot of good things can come if you maintain a long-term relationship with your customers. Like, for example, if you guys subscribe to the channel, this video channel, hint, 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 subscribe. Um, you know, I mean, I'll be able to have, you know, kind of provide you with instructions and tutorials and, and you know, help help sort of like give you knowledge that I you know knowledge that I have search I, I mean, I'll be able to share it with you um, and then you know so so that's a really good way for us to keep in touch right because and if I have anything new going on I'll be able that's how I'll be able to like tell you guys if people who subscribe if nobody subscribed if I don't have like a mailing list a social media account or you know then it's hard so you wanna Structure your business in a way that you have a long-term relationship with your customer and you have some kind of a way either to subscriptions or another way to uh, get that recurring revenue going because it's one of the better revenue models that exist. So that's been it. Um, you know, uh, I'll have more videos like that on different kind of revenue models like how to make money with different you know, ads, affiliates selling things uh, but this one was specifically about recurring revenue with subscriptions because they are so great and like it, it's like the the holy grail of revenue models if you can pull it off I mean it's not easy because you know consumers are finicky you know they're here one day they're gone the next day on to the next product so it's hard to actually get a consumer to have a long-term relationship with you but if you're able to then it's amazing. So that's it. Um, please, subscribe, you know, if you like the video, if it was helpful, if you learned something, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, that's kind of how it helps me because I'm able to grow the channel a little bit. And um, please also check out my mobile apps that I create and where I also I share a lot of knowledge um, and real like real world tips and kind of advice. Uh, starting a business, growing a business. And my apps are, you know, you can check them out on problemio.com. They're available also on the App Store, on iOS, Kindle, Android, or, you know, you can just go to problemio.com and see all the apps there. Um, so thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.